Hello everyone, welcome again and uh, going to continue this uh, AngularJS tutorial. In this tutorial, we will see how to use ng class directive, ng class even, or ng class or directive. Let's just start the coding and uh, here I am going to already create that uh, project setup. How to create setup? If you don't know, please watch my previous video. You will easily find how to create that uh, complete setup in uh, Eclipse. Okay. So how to use that angular JS? Just I'm going to create a CSS here for two CSS for a red color background set red and for blue color background color set background. And this body tag I'm going to use angular JS app. So ng app is here, and I'm going to use a drop down value, a drop down tag, and uh, select inside that select, and this is a home or something. If user select red, then CSS the red CSS will call and if user select blue then blue will be call and uh, this selector I'm going to pass that home value and this ng class tag so let's see the practical view how it will work as so a practically I'm going to run it finish this I need a real-time browser for this uh, previous yeah if I'm gonna see, choose this red color, it's red. If I'm gonna choose blue, it's blue. If you want to add more something like dot black or light blue, so I'm gonna create a class L blue and background for this class. This background class is blue, green, gray. Yeah, it's uh, green, I think. So, so I'm gonna change this color green and i'm going to add one more option here that option is green green okay let's see the output sorry blue it's green here is the text is green that's it Okay, so by the help of AngularJS, you can change the real-time CSS classes in your code, HTML code. First, I've discussed that ng class. Now I'm going to discuss how to use that ng uh, class old or ng class even. So um, for this, I have to write a script take. So I'm going to create a folder here that called JS folder. Inside this JS folder, I'm going to create a file index.js and here I'm going to create a module the module call variable app is a angular dot module and the module name is be my app and inside this I'm going to create a controller so controller inside this controller my CDRL and uh, here I'm going to create a function inside this I want to pass that if you don't know how to create that what is that thing uh, scope and uh, what is this module and controller you can watch previous video and you will easily understand so in this controller I'm going to create a uh, array and uh, dollar scope dot x will be my array's name and in this array I'm going to define some values one two three four five six something like that and uh, here now I'm going to use that app that's called my app and controller is called controller it's not suggesting me why controller yeah. my CDI I think this is the name my controller yeah so for a sec I'm going to remove this or you can use this so yeah, I'm going to remove this and uh, this also and inside this I'm going to create a div folder div and in this div I'm going to use ng repeat to retrieve that value x in x the scope name is x x in x okay 
so I want this value from the x and here in the expression tag I'm going to retrieve the text just check the output this is just showing x only something is wrong here so it's not giving the right output there is some mistake we have to use that ng controller and here I'm going to script that file link this file here so I'm going to script and in this script I'm going to source directory is js inside the js folder that index file and something is again wrong okay now thing is done I'm going to reload this so you can check one two three four five six how to use that ng uh, class odd ng class even first I'm going to use even in this even class I'm going to pass that uh, blue CSS this blue class so the CSS so in the array of the every or even position it will change the color oh, it's not going to change I think Yeah, you can see here in that every odd position, every even position, it's changing the color. And if I use that odd ng class odd, and uh, I'm going to test it again. So in the odd position, it will change the uh, background color. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this, please subscribe my channel. And for source code, you can go there and code onecom and search for the ng class directive and i will provide all the links below the video and description box and uh, thank you